These are the ideal male bodies for each sport. You may not like it, but this is what peak performance looks like. Swimming, basketball, and esports. Oh my goodness, yep. I'm not surprised with esports, honestly. A lot of people who do that stuff are furry after all. And, um, well, it would be very exciting when we can find the day when a lot of basketball and swimming players are, um, you know, furries as well. I mean, I'm not trying to say I want to see them fursuiters with buff bodies and posting pics, but, um, yeah, I don't, you know, you, you, you heard nothing. Unlike y'all, I get my news from a reliable source. Oh my, well, um, this totally feels very, very reliable right there. Makes me explaining how kind, cute and kind fairies are. My now fairy friends are oh, uh, <laughs> Well, I mean honestly, you're not gonna change people's opinions if they're very sad about they don't like something, or they're not really interested in it, then you're not really gonna change their opinion and I don't think you should be bothering to do so as well. Keep calm and nom a cookie, oh my, yes. Knowing a cookie is very great because um, you get energy when you eat them and um, they taste good too. Boy Kisser is just Pepe for furries if you think about it. Oh my well honestly it, it does feel like that to be honest. I mean it's very thingy everywhere and everything, but honestly it feels like it's dying down, not entirely, but it seems like it's getting lower. Ah, oh, look at the cute protogen. Who wants a snack? For the last time, I cannot eat ram. Oh my yes. Stop boring the protogen. In reality, they are just like us, I believe they eat normal food rather than RAM because they are technically also organic. When you're not you're with your non-fairy friends and you start talking fairy language. Oh my yep, yeah, they will start be like, what's going on? Why are you talking like that? I'm I'm very suspicious of you, yep. Yeah, it's rightfully so, I mean it's a bit weird. Don't go like that in public. It's a bit embarrassing as well, but I mean if you do want to do that, I'm not going to stop you either way. I'm just warning you that people might not take to the best to it. I'm not a fairy, you see. Would a fairy be Mario? No, they wouldn't be Mario, so clearly I'm not a fairy. That dog was even convincing no one, oh my. Yeah, but that really doesn't convince, it's simply just a mask. You've got to try a lot more harder. You want a slice of cake? Oh my, yes. Would you want Boy Kisser to give you a slice of cake? Tell me down in the comments section. I don't trust it though, I think it might be poisoned, so I'm going to avoid it and pass it to the viewers watching this video. So here is a coupon. Free cuddles, uses unlimited. Expires never. Keep this coupon. Oh my, uh, yes. I think I will keep it, it, it seems very useful. What normies want to find at Area 51? Alien guns, anime girls. What furries want to find? Oh my, yes, Puro. Well, I mean, that's probably the more likely thing because it's an experiment. So I feel like if Area 51 wants to be anything suspicious or secretive, it would be most likely experimenting on stuff and that's about it. Honestly, my opinion, I think it's just a military base that's over glorified. I found, oh, <laughs> I founded my own company and I'm a director general. I'm happily married man and my kids are great. I'm a professional photographer and I enjoy my job. I caught a pigeon, oh, <laughs> yes, some of us just want to enjoy life like that, in the moment I guess, you could say, of catching a pigeon. <laughs> How to stop a protogen? The recapture is asking you, are you a robot? And the protogen's like, hmm, technically they kind of are I guess, I don't know. It really depends on people's concept of protogen. Are they robots or are they cyborgs? And are cyborgs technically not robots or are they technically... It's the grey area, I guess. They're technically not robots in my opinion, but you might be different. non fur I swear I'm not a furry. I just like Nick Wilde. Me. Are you sure you're not a furry? Hmm, yeah, I mean... I think you might be, but they always say they're not when they are, don't they? On furry stuff, I guess. Hey, human, I have something to tell you. Piero, what happened? Oh my, Piero is T-posing on them. Oh no, I mean T-posing and T-like posing as well. I don't know, I think Piero is going to transfer them. Me explaining that every meme format needs a furry version. Normies, huh? Oh my, yep, I mean, honestly, yeah. I think that's, that's kind of like furry memes pretty much, yeah. I saw this while driving and I almost crashed. You woo, you woo street, oh my goodness, I mean, please don't crash, you're going to turn it into a, a, a sadowoo face, whatever that is. 
Oh my goodness, it's a pizza. I know exactly what this is referencing, but I don't think I can say it on YouTube. I know, like mine. Oh my, yes. It just looks like a certain waffle if you've ever seen that thing. Huh? And then he sees them with like the, the massive like ice pop though and like, I want one jumbo pop too. That's too big for you. We can show too icy for me, but quit it. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, but they're, they're not going to get it. This person doesn't seem very interested in Don't worry, we'll take good care of you, big guy. You're so tense. Thanks, I'm counting on you guys. Oh my goodness, oh my. <laughs> yeah, we all know what's about to happen now, oh my gosh. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this episode and make sure to subscribe. Also, make sure to stay if you want to see who's been featured in the comments part of this video. And also, check out the pinned comment down below to find the secret episode that you can watch and see extra content. Let's get on to this comments part of the video now. And if you're going to check out the secret episode, I hope you enjoy it. Not Radio Gamer said, Still don't know if I'm a furry. My boyfriend is on board about me being a furry if I became one. I think he wants me to be a furry more than I do. It was great closet, I mean, it sounds like he's probably a furry as well. Albatross YT replied to them as well with OO. I replied, only be one if you want to be, like, don't let anyone force you into doing something that you might or might not want to be in, like, honestly, just if you're comfortable with being a furry, you could be a furry. If you don't want to be one, you don't have to be one. Thomas McKingstree 327 said, love your videos. Oh, thank you so much, and I'm glad you enjoy my content. I hope you continue to do so into the future as well. RetroWave09 said, these videos always makes me feel better. Oh, I'm, I'm glad that they do, and I hope that they continue to do so into the future as well. ZebSky4DE7HP said, I would love to see some ASMR from you. I replied, perhaps sometime with Colon Free. I do plan on doing ASMR videos, I just don't know what to do it on. Um, you know, there's a lot more planning involved, and I'm not very great at that stuff, so yeah, we're gonna have to find out what, how to do one and research on that. Alex HT 3 mo said, Now that you hit 30,000, let's go for 1 million. I replied, Soon, hopefully. Honestly, yeah, well, our channel's growing very fast. Hopefully, we'll be at 1 million, but I know that's gonna be a long time, honestly. We just need to hit 100,000 and then we can think of a million. I mean, it's been a day or two since I was at 30k and I'm now almost at 3. 31,000, so it is growing quite fast. Limited H2O said, The fact that you upload every day is actually insane. Oh, thank you so much, and yep, we do videos every day. I try my best to get them out as soon as, like, once a day, because that's, that's how you can get the freshest memes out there. Anyway, I'll see you all next time. Have an amazing day. Goodbye.